self-care walk, so I thought I'd bring you along because it's like so nice not to share. Um, yeah, excuse this like red nose. <laughs> I was out walking and I got bit by whatever and so now I'm like Rudolph the red nose around here But it's just so beautiful. It's such a nice day I have to share it So I'm walking around and Can you believe it? Only this side is wet this is completely dry. But say, hey, come sit down and enjoy this view. I'm pretty sure someone just like wiped this seat off. <laughs> and I just happened to find it, but let's believe in a little bit of serendipity. Why not? Past few weeks have been a little bit crazy. I'm a little bit on um, break from just like work life and stuff. I was originally planning to make it into a like plan my social media stuff. But no, didn't quite happen. I just needed to rest. The rest is good. Don't kick yourself for needing rest, ever. Because you're human and uh, don't let capitalism get to you. Anyways, you're human. You need to rest. You need to reconnect. You need some self-care. Reach out to people. Take care of yourself. Eat. Work out. Take care of your body. Take care of your mind. And then practice healthily. <laughs> Hope you're practicing practicing. You know what I'm kidding about that. You know what to do. To practice. To practice. Practice for me. Just came back from my walk and fell asleep on the couch. And I took her spot. So she fell asleep on me. She's crying right now so I'm not going to disturb her. I like just finished uh, recording the Mozart. I'm gonna go and finally meet Tiffany. And I was planning to like record with my bigger camera. Hold on, let's fucking grab it. My um, bigger camera, but the mic's not working, so I hope I can figure it out. But I'm late. I gotta go, and um, I'll see you in the next clip. Bye. I think I see her walking aimlessly around. I saw her around this corner. Yo, she's right there. Look at us! Look at us! <laughs> Are we both vlogging right at this moment? Yo, I love your case! Thank you! I love your case! Hi, hi Michelle. Hi, Tiffany. <laughs> yeah, look at us. We are We're both gonna have like the vlogging. same same footage. Yes. <laughs> look at our so skill as vloggers already. There we go. We're finally eating. I'll show you what I have. She's already done good. Yeah. For Sorry. those who don't know, this is Tiffany C Piano. I'll show you guys. Go check out our channel. I'll put all the, the socials and stuff everywhere. But um, now that the restrictions have loosened, we are finally able to get together. For the first time. Yes, for the first time. We've been wanting to do some like forehand stuff. So once it loosens, maybe stage three. Yeah. But I have. Oh, a new. No, I don't have that. Lobster roll. I mean, I'll lobster sandwich, grilled sandwich. Like not your main footage, so if I was to do like a oh, that's what it means. I should have been seeing that term, but I don't know what yeah. it means. <laughs> Three, two, one. Cheers. What did you get? Don't like that. <laughs> Are you always go, uh, like? Do you always do milk tea? Is your go-to? Um, I actually really like their milk tea here. Mm. That's why I'm wondering. But if I go to an HK cafe, it's like, what is their milk tea like? 
is the legit. So I'm on a quest on making like really good HP milk tea. Oh yes, I know, I've watched your vlogs. Yeah. You've been trying to make it. But um, the funny thing is like I've never been to HP, so like, I don't <gasps> know what. <laughs> You've never been to No, I've never been. <gasps> yeah. Oh, wow. So I'm a little bit sad because like if I go now or in the future, it's like never gonna be the same. Yeah. I was born there, so. Oh. Um, but I still don't go back often. Maybe once every four to five years. And when did you move here? When I was four. So I still grew up here. Mm. But because I was born there, somehow it still feels like home. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I didn't know that. I thought you were born here. But it, like every time I go back, it's a huge change because it's four or five years. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I just finished a meeting with Tiffany. Girl, you're so cool. I hope you had a lot of fun chatting and eating food. I had a lot of fun and it is hot in this car. But we had a lovely, lovely chat about social media, what it's like, and be a pianist, life stuff. There's gonna be another video of just us talking about this kind of, it's gonna be kind of podcasty. I don't know what to make of it, but we got into like a really interesting deep conversation. Got to get to know each other too, so I'm gonna post that up sometime soon. But yeah, Tiff, you are awesome. I can't wait to do some of that forehand stuff with you. It's gonna be so good. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go and drive home, do some research. I'll see you in the next clip. Hi guys. I'm at a high park in Toronto for a little picnic. We're trying to find a place. It is really hot. We're under like a heat wave, so excuse how um, sweaty I look. But uh, yeah, we're under a heat wave. But we're gonna go outside and eat anyways and be all healthy. Check out, check out that. We'll go check that out after lunch. Yeah. Nah, we were cool. Oh my God, look at this, look at this. There's like a little train that carries you all around high park. That is so cute. Maybe you can go on it. I, I high key want to go on it. Maybe after lunch if it like comes back around. Go. What do you mean if it comes back around? I think it will. <laughs> Where's it gonna go? <laughs> All right, so we just finished lunch and uh, we just remembered that there is a zoo at High Park. We were debating earlier if we should uh, go to the zoo or take the train that just uh, came by. Cause we're saying that we'd only get on the train if it came by. Let's go to the high park zoo. I think we're here. Oh, we they're are. Just, they're just, it's quite hot today, so. Oh, true. These are mouflon lambs. wonder if I can, like, get it for you guys. Everyone watching. <gasps> they're so cute. There's a peacock over there. They're really vibrant in the colors. Wow. I think there's a mountain goat. It is. It's a barberry sheep. Their horns are hollow and made of hard skin. Go See, you don't come to me just for piano education. <laughs> also, nature education. They look really hot. I hope they have like some water bucket. Oh, there's one right there! I hope they have some like a uh, water bucket around. I'm sure they do. That blue one. Yeah. Really? I was gonna say he looks so wise. Like if it was reborn from a wizard, this is what a wizard would look like. <laughs> llama part. This is a very sensible llama. These ones over here, however, not so sensible. They're just like chilling in the heat. I am ready to see my favorite. There is still, a We're Highland still pretty Canal. far from it. I feel like they, they cut the hair on this one's eyes a little bit. Oh, they definitely. I think they also shaved it down so far. Look, look, it's a Highland cow. Aren't they so cute? It's 
nose is so cute. It looks so fluffy. This one's way bigger than the one that I saw. Oh, really? The, the horns, I mean, oh. much longer. It looks so soft. There's another one. There's another one. Look at this hair here. Oh. Do you want some? No, thank you. I do not want to lock up his hair. We have lists, not his. Let's go check out the other cow. Come on. The cow. Safari mission with Michelle. Its horns are different, eh? It is. It's more upwards. Yeah. Oh, you kind of dropped something. Let me know on this lovely safari expedition thing. Which animal did you like the most? And is it also heat wave of 40 degrees Celsius where you live? 